All right, students. So in your written test, one of the very important part is the comprehension. And then for comprehension, there is no multiple choice. You need to answer one by one with full answer. So here, you'll get the passage something like this. But now, Lao Shi, here, Lao Shi prepared three topics to cover all the six chapters. Your, your class, you get the first part. It's about the chapter one and two, the one that you get. It's about family. Okay, so other class, they will get the one for the uh, daily life. Okay, another class will get for the uh, sports, that kind. Okay, so here, after reading this, you are going to answer. So, I should prepare a few questions here. Okay, and also tell you how to answer. Okay, so later on, you see there are others. Okay. Uh, you also need to follow the teaching videos in the U Future for other parts. Okay, we have no time to discuss everything with you. Okay, how? So now, Lao Shu will read and Lao Shu will explain. Okay, you listen. Huh? And in the text, right, you cannot spend very long here, huh, students. Uh, if you spend more than 10 minutes here, your other parts you cannot finish. Okay, so how to make this faster? You need to be uh, strong. I mean your vocab, you need to remember them well. Okay, read ready. Kama shi peng heng ren. Kama is orang pahang, the pahang people. Ta de lao jia zai guan dan. His hometown is in guan dan. Guan dan. Kama shi sha anan ma la gong yi da xue de xue sheng. Kama is the student of UITM Sha Alam. Xinqi Wu Wan Shang, the night of Friday, Kama Chang Chang Hui Lao Jia Kan Jia Ren. Kama always go back hometown to visit the family members. Okay, how? Kama the Jia Yo Baba, Mama, Yiga Jie Jie, Yiga Di Di, Her Liang Ge Mei Mei. In Kama's house, he has father, mother, uh, an elder sister, a younger sis a younger brother, and two younger brother younger sisters. Six. Kama may yo gurga. Ta the jia yo chiga ren. Kama does not have an elder brother. So his family, there are seven people in his family. In your test, there is no numbering here. Now should put the numbering here is to, to help you answer. For the below questions. Okay. Seven. Kama the Baba Shi Yiga Gong Chang Shi. Kama's father is an engineer. Ta Jin Yan Wu Shi Si Sui. This year he is 54. Okay, age of 54. Ta Zai Sha Anan the Shun Li Gong Si Gong Zuo. So he works at Sha Alam in the Shunli company. Kama the mama Wu Shi Suila. Kama's mother is age of fifty. Ta meo gong zuo. She does not work. Ta shi yi ge jia ting zhu fu. She is an, she is a housewife. Kama the jie jie li na. Jie hun le. So Kama's elder sister has married. Ta de xian sheng shi ai man. His hus her husband is ai man. Li na shi ji long po yi yuan de yi sheng. Li na, his sister, his elder sister is a doctor in the in in the Kuala Lumpur hospital. Ai man zai yin hang gong zuo. Ai Man works in a bank. Ta shi kuai ji shi. He is an accountant. Ta men you yi ge er zi luo si li he yi ge nu er luo si na. They have a son, Rosalie, and a daughter, Rosna. Luo si li san sui le. Rosalie is at age of three. Ta hen cong ming. He is very clever. 
罗斯纳一岁了 ，Rosna age of one， 她很可爱 ，She's very cute。卡玛的妹妹叫莉亚和莉莉 ，So Karma is having two sisters, two younger sisters. Okay, 叫 the name is the names are Liya and Lily. 弟弟叫卡利 His younger brother is Khalid. 他们在中学念书 They are studying in the secondary school. Okay, so after you have understood the passage, right? You need to ask answer the question. For example, I should ask. Karma is 哪里人 Karma is orang mana? Okay, from where? Karma originated lah. Oh, okay, so karma is 彭亨人 Remember here? Karma is 彭亨人 Karma 的老家在哪里 Where is Karma's hometown? Karma 的老家在关丹，在关丹 Okay, but now. Because Kama is a student of UITM Shah Alam, so where does he live actually now? Kama 住在哪里 So the answer is Kama 住在 Shah Anan, Shah Anan. But you cannot say UITM lah unless we tell you that he lives in the hostel. If we don't know whether he lives in a hostel, uh, in a UITM or not, you have to answer just Shah Anan. Okay, Kama 住在沙阿南。好 ，the next question. Kama 的家有几个人 ？How many people in Kama's house? So it's 七个人。How do you know 七个人 ？Okay, here, here. You see number six. Here, but you cannot copy from Kama. 没有哥哥，他的家有七个人。If you do that, five marks. You will get only two marks. Because you don't digest the question, you can just pick the key answer. Seven people here, okay? Because they ask you, Kama 的家有几个人 Okay. Before answering, look for the question word. So, 几 is the question word. Got the answer? Throw them. Include the key word. Number two, Kama 的爸爸做什么工作 Okay, what is the job for Kama's papa? So, 老师 told you, 做什么工作 What could you upper throw away? And so, answer Kama 的爸爸是一个工程师 Okay, where do you know that Kama 的爸爸 There, there, Kama 的爸爸 number seven. Okay, 是一个工程师 engineer. Okay, next one. Li Na 是谁 Who is Lina? Okay, 老师 show you the answer now. Lina is Kama's sister. But in the exam, if you do not know, you need to find here. You see, Kama's sister Lina. So you see, the question may not be direct. Okay, 老师 ask Kama's sister 是谁？是谁 ？You have to follow the style here. Come. Ah, Li. Oh no, teacher asks you, Li Na is who? You know, it's reverse. You can't find this sentence directly in the text. You have to understand and know that Li Na is Kama's sister. Number four, Aiman is where he works. Aiman is where he works. So you see, when you answer, follow the the flow. Don't change the flow. Orang tempat kata kerja. So Aiman 在哪里工作 ？Aiman 在银行工作。How do you know Aiman 在银行工作 ？There, there, number fifteen. Aiman 在银行工作。他是会计师。But 他是会计师。You don't give this answer because we don't ask you that. Okay. Number five. Lina 和 Aiman 有没有孩子 ？Lina 跟 Aiman ada tak ada anak？ 有没有？有 ，so answer. Lina 和 Aim Aiman 有孩子。And lastly, Lina 结婚了吗 ？Has Lina married? Or not only last? You see, many more questions can be asked. Lina 结婚了吗 ？Of course, the answer is 
，丽娜结婚了。丽娜和艾曼有几个孩子 ？How many children do they have？ 两个，罗斯利 and 罗斯娜 ，isn't it？ So you will look at you take the z, take the z. Okay, okay, take out the z and put in 两 All right. 丽娜的手机几号？丽娜的手机几号 ？You go and find 几号 ？And answer with the 是。Okay, finally, 丽娜和艾曼的家的电话号码几号 ？Okay, this one 老师 may not ask you, but if let's say they ask you, you need to understand. 家 is room. You have to find the house number. If 手机 is handphone number. Okay, 好的 students. So 老师 will stop here. Okay, so this is for the see the whole thing.